This video is sponsored by Envato Elements. Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. Design video product faster, with Envato Elements, get unlimited downloads, After Effects templates, stock footages, fonts, music files, web templates and many more. Visit the Envato Elements, check the first link in the description, and get 70% discount on first month subscription. To create this title, you need to have installed Saba plugin, Saba plugin is available for free. Download link is provided in the description. Now let's start with creating the trailer title. Create a new composition. Here I will name it as trailer. Time duration 2, just 3 seconds. Remaining everything will be same. Now let's create a new solid layer. This will be our background layer. Now in effects and preset, search for fill. Add it to the background layer. Here you can set any color of your choice for the background. Now in effects and preset, search for noise. Add it to the background layer. Set amount of noise to 5%. Now let's add the text. Here I will use Biba's new font family. Perfect. Here you can position the text to center or you can align it to the center. For this text, make sure paragraph alignment is set to right align text. Place text to center. Perfect. Here our text one is ready. Now let's add subtext. For this subtext, Make sure paragraph alignment is set to left text. Now position the text to center. Perfect. Now we will animate the text layer. For text layer, in animate, select tracking. Now at near about 20 frames. Create keyframe for tracking. Now at distance of 5 frames, change tracking to 100. You can see the preview. Now for text layer, press P to bring up position. At 1 second, create keyframe for position. Now at start, change X position value as shown. Now press T to bring up opacity. At near about 25 frames. Create keyframe for opacity. Now at 10 frames, change opacity to 0%. You can see the preview. Now let's adjust the speed graph for position. Select end keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now we will do the same for other text layer. From animate select tracking. At 20 frames, create keyframe for tracking. Now at 5 frames, change tracking amount to 100. Now press P to bring up position. At 1 second, create keyframe for position. At start. Change X position value as shown. Select end keyframe, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. Press T to bring up opacity. Now at 25 frames, 
create keyframe for opacity. At 10 frames, change opacity to 0%. You can see the preview. Now for this text layer, in effects and preset, search for fill, add it to the text layers. Here you can set any color of your choice for this text layer, perfect. I will set the same color for both the text layers. Perfect. Now let's create a new solid layer, this will be our Saba layer. From effects, video copilot, select Saba. Now let's set the preset to, Proton. Now in customize core, select core type to, text layer. Now select the text layer. Set core size to, 3. Now at start of the timeline, create keyframe for mask evolution. Now at near about 1 second and 10 frames, change mask evolution to, 45 degrees. You can see the preview. Now at start of the timeline, create keyframe for start offset. Now at 1 second and 10 frames, change start offset to, 100. You can see the preview. Now at 1 second, create keyframe for end offset. At start of the timeline, change end offset to, 0%. You can see the preview. For Sabo layer, press U to view created keyframes, select end offset keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now select end keyframe for mask and start offsets, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. In glow setting, change glow intensity to 10. Perfect. For this sable layer, change mode to add. Perfect. Now let's create duplicate of this sable layer. For duplicate sable layer, change core size to 2. Now press U to view created keyframes, now for end keyframe for mask evolution, change it to, 55 degrees. Now for start offset, change it to, 35%. For end offset, change it to, 45%. You can see the preview. Let's change the glow intensity to, 35. Now create another duplicate of the Sable layer. For this Sable layer, let's change the preset to, Hardcore, set glow intensity to, 25%. Set core size to, 0.70. Now press U to view keyframes, for end offset keyframe, change end value to 100%. Let's remove start offset keyframes. Set start offset to 0%. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's create duplicate of these three Sabre layers. Place them above. For this three Sabre layer, we will change the text layer to subtext. Now you can see the preview.
Now to create outro effect for the text, select text layers, press P to bring up position. Now at distance of 1 second, create position keyframes. Now at end of the timeline, change X position value as shown. Select the end keyframes, adjust the speed graph as shown. Now you can see the complete preview. Similarly, you can create multiple titles and create your trailer. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial, see you next week with another awesome tutorial.